Welcome to jazzham.com. Jazzham.com is an online store that buys, sells, trades authentic luxury watches. We make these videos so our customers can easily choose the best watch for themselves and then come to their own home. We'll offer the lowest prices anywhere online and if you want to know the price of the watch, simply click on the links in the description below. We greatly appreciate it if you will buy a watch from jazzham.com once in a while. Today we'll be reviewing the Rolex Datejust 31. This is the model number 278288RBR. We'll be going over the dial, bezel, case, crown, bracelet, clasp, and we'll talk about the movement towards the end of the video. All right, so jumping right into the dial here, you can see this is one of the most luxurious um, dial configurations you can get from the Rolex line on the Datejust, on the, specifically for the Datejust models. This is a diamond pave dial with butterfly mother uh, with butterfly shaped mother of pearl sets. These are all hand set and hand hand shaped for the dial itself. The, sh the setting for the mother of pearl butterflies, I'm gonna zoom in into the dial a little bit here. You can see it's just very thinly marked by a outline of 18 karat yellow gold for the settings. And of course, even all the, uh, even all the sparkling from the um, small diamond pave on the dial as well are all set in the 18 karat yellow gold. So you have this beautiful contrast of, you know, the shine from the diamonds, the nice sort of yellow from the small tint of yellow from all these set, the yellow gold settings from the face of the watch. And then you have this beautiful, unique butterfly shaped mother of pearl um, butterflies that capture light, you know, in a very different way compared to the rest of the watch. Whereas, you know, the unique, you know, as light hits the face of the watch, the pave will shine, uh, the pave diamonds will shine along with the, you know, the diamond set bezel also set in that 18 karat uh, yellow gold as well. I believe the the bezel itself is around like uh, around a carat weight or so with about like 40, I believe around 46 set diamonds. The diamonds all will naturally, you know, sparkle in the sunlight, capturing light in its own way. But the mother of pearl, it's unique. Every mother of pearl slice that gets set into here will have that different shades that it will capture light. So you all have this very interesting, interesting, unique style dial to look at. As you can see, as I tilt in my light box, the, you know, you would, uh, you can see different contrast shades of that the coloration of the mother of pearl just sort of shift around. So it gives this dial a very uniqueness to it. And each dial will be just a little bit different than the other, uh, just if from someone else's. So if you were to, just, you know, if you purchase this one and someone else purchases this one, those mother of pearl shavings will be a, different from each other and you'll have a unique style watch to yourself. Okay. But besides that, we still have, you know, the typical data structure of having the Rolex crown logo at the 12 o'clock position. Instead, we have the Rolex text right underneath that plated in that 18 karat yellow gold as well, contrasting very nicely with that yellow gold plating. At the three o'clock position, we still have that date window for with a Cyclops lens on top of that sapphire crystal for magnification, easier viewing of that date. But as you can see, very, very elegant dial. However, if I didn't, if I, however, if I didn't sell you on how beautiful this watch is, you can also choose other options as well. It's a Datejust watch. Datejust watches have numerous different configurations, specifically for this model. If you enjoy having that 18 karat yellow gold for the whole for the whole of the watch, then the other dial configurations configurations available to you, you can get it in index hour markers, diamond hour markers, Roman numerals, all set in that 18 karat yellow gold. Um, but also you can also have different dial colors as well. Your available, your available colors are champagne, white. I believe this comes in a olive green as well, also in a brown. So different configurations and you know, really it's up to your personal preference. But for this specific video, this I'm showing you the top of the line, best dial configuration you can get from Rolex um, that will give you a run for your money. All right, so that's the dial. I already mentioned the bezel is about 46, I believe about 46 set diamonds with uh, about carat weight of diamonds on the bezel of the watch. Um, Rolex doesn't typically update their update their uh, website with the um, actual carat weight of the pave on the dial, so I can't give you that information. But I believe some sources say that the the bezel itself is around a carat weight for that 40 about 46 uh, 46 set diamonds. 
All right, moving on to the case now. The case is a, as the name states, is a Rolex Stage S31. So it's a 31 millimeter watch. So from an index finger to my thumb here, this is 31 millimeters in diameter. You can see from the profile, actually not too, of course, it's a very small profile from the side profile of the watch. It's not gonna be, it's not a very large watch. So of course the height of the watch wouldn't be very large as well. And it's a very simple complication for the movement, which I'll talk about here in a second. Um, so you have very, uh, you know, the movement itself isn't very complicated, not so it doesn't command a larger case sizing. So this watch will fit under those suit cuffs, dress cuffs very nicely. But as it's a dress watch, beautiful high polish from the side of the case, side of the bezel, matching with the sides of the bracelet. Also on the lugs of the case as well, very beautiful high polish as well. And a very beautiful high polish on the other, on the other parts of the lugs as well. So top of the lugs are here bottom of the lugs here all right one thing the one thing to mention at this current at this current point is that this is actually an updated updated from the previous model the previous model is a 178288 rbr uh, that existed they did a few updates we do have a comparison video of that so you can see them side by side just check out check out our youtube channel for that um, but the minor the minor changes that they did for this watch from updating it from the previous model was that they changed the lug size. So we have thinner lugs and also a thinner case overall. Um, and we have some other changes as well, but that's one of the main changes. As with Rolex, they're trying to update all of their watches. I believe even the most recent change was on the Submariner. They've sort of giving it the original Datejust treatment, the Datejust 2 and Datejust 41, where they sort of just slim down, a, basically trying to reproportion their watches, making them nice and slim and more elegant uh, overall. All right, moving on to the crown now. So the crown is, of course, 18 karat yellow gold crown as well. So. Just want to show you that side of the crown. You can see marked by two dot entities right underneath that crown logo, meaning that this watch is a to unlock and double waterproofness system. Uh, me that's meaning that this watch has the standard um, water resistance that most Rolex watches have, which is 100 meters or 330 feet. On one end of the crown counterclockwise, we'll open up that crown into the standard position. And the standard position is where you can wind the watch about 15 to 20 uh, clockwise turns. That's all you need to get the watch started once more. Pulling the crown out to the next position will allow you to adjust the date instantaneously by going counterclockwise, as you see. And pulling the crown out to the final position uh, will actually stop the second time. I'm going to stop it at the 6 o'clock position here, or close to it. And that allows for precise time settings, such as to atomic, clock on, uh, atomic clocks online. You can set it down to the exact seconds, and then you'll be able to move the hands by direction and set the time however you like. I'm just going to set it back to the 10 and 2 position. All right, press the crown back in. We'll start that second time once more. And always make sure to screw the crown nice and tight in against the case as you want to keep this watch water resistance once again, 100 meters or 330 feet. Moving on to the bracelet now. This is a president style bracelet available on the day, available on this day just watch. Uh, as you can see, they're just a semicircular links. Very, sim very similar to, you know, the president bracelet you would get on a day to eight watch. So it's a half semi-circular links, three-piece links, nice mirror finish down the center, and uh, with a brush finish on the outer of the three-piece links. And that goes throughout the whole bracelet. As you can see, continues that same patterning. This runs a concealed folding crown clasp, as noted, notated by the Rolex crown logo here. So that means the clasp can be opened up from here to put the watch on your wrist. And you can see very beautiful embossment of the Rolex logo, or Rolex name, onto the clasp blade itself there which is high polished. I'm going to close that back up because I want you to see the other side of the bracelet even though it's the same. I love to give a full rotational view of the bracelet so you see what you're getting. Nice tapering from the first leg down. Even on these 31 millimeter watches, these smaller watches, they still have proportions in mind. So they still even have just a slight bit of tapering from the links back. And once again, I want to show you the clasp. So once again, this is the concealed folding crown clasp as you would typically see on uh, on a president bracelet and also on Jubilee bracelets as well. Um, actually, they've actually most recently stopped doing them on Jubilee bracelets. Only older style Jubilee bracelets will have this concealed folding crown clasp. All right. So let me actually go, uh, let me actually show you the back of the case now. 
so this is the back of the case of course is where the movement is housed as you see a nice sand finish oops nice sand finish on the case back there nice boring uh, nice boring high polish around the around that edge for the movement itself for the movement itself uh, we're looking at a updated movement. It used to run a 2235 movement on the previous model, which again wants that one, uh, 178288 RBR, but now we're moved on to uh, a new, a newer style movement. This is the in-house made movement by Rolex of Perpetual Mechanical Self-Winding Movement. It's a caliber 2236 movement, so it has a precision of minus two plus two seconds a day uh, for precise time, uh, for precise timekeeping has the functions, as I mentioned, of the center hour, minute, and seconds hand with the instantaneous changing of the date and stopping at a seconds hand with precise time setting, as I've shown you with the crown functions. The oscillator the oscillator is a Siloxi hairspring and is silicone, meaning that uh, this watch has additional resistance against magnetism. And uh, there's also high performance paraflex, sh paraflex shock absorbers, which are in-house made shock absorbers by Rolex. The industry standard shock, shock absorbers are the KIF, which they used to use in previous movements, uh, but Rolex has been moving towards more in-house made parts. So now we have that update to that shock absorber as well. The power reserve of this watch, you're looking at a 55 hour power reserve. Meaning you could put this watch down on a Friday, push it, put this watch down on a Friday evening, pick it back up on a Sunday evening, and it'll be keeping time just fine. All right, now let, let me actually show you this watch on my wrist. So we're going to open up that concealed folding crown class here. All right, I do have an average man size wrist, so this is going to fit a little, a little bit tight on me. As this is a smaller watch, so it should fit a little bit smaller wrist. Okay, as you can see. Very beautiful Mother Pro butterflies, Pave diamonds. Just, it's just absolutely very unique looking looking face of a Rolex watch. This is not a sort of the dial you would expect from Rolex if you're you know walking around and about and you happen to walk past the window, be head turning and they will see this very very beautiful unique style dial. But overall, still has a Rolex look of the present bracelet. Beautiful case, beautiful polishing of the bracelet. You can see goes nicely throughout and you can see once again profile not high off the wrist as it is a smaller watch so if you're interested in this model or any other model for the lowest possible price check out our website at jazzhand.com we have the lowest prices guaranteed and if you like the video please like comment subscribe below thanks for watching hope to see you guys soon if you want to find out more about the watch you just saw in the video, you can just click below on show more to see the full description. Then you can check the link next to model as seen in video, click on it and you will get to the proper page where you can see all the details. If you're watching on a mobile phone, you have to click on the arrow down on the right hand side below the video to see the full description. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. If you would like to share this video with your friends, you can use the share button below and share it on any platform you like. If you have questions, constructive feedback, want to tell us about some mistakes or misspeaks, just write a comment below. If you want to see more videos like this, you should subscribe to our channel and visit our channel page where you can find all the videos. And if you're interested in a specific watch brand, you can check out our playlists. If you want to check the price for a watch or want to buy one, remember at jazztime.com you always get a steep discount, so you should check the prices with us. If you want to know the price for a specific watch, just go to Google, type in jazztime, plus the brand, model and the details you're interested in and Google will find the right page for you. Thank you for watching.